Hello everybody, this is Blade Cross EXE, and welcome to Fate Grand Order's Onigashima Rerun High Difficulty Quest. An Oni called Mother. Oh, that's a lot of enemies. I think it's a gauntlet of fighting all the Onis and then fighting, uh... Fighting Minamoto no Raiko herself. So I'm just gonna go and swing and do the best that I can. Alright, round one. Ah, yes. Gorikimaru. Well, this is not the best setup, but okay. Let's try this. Let me see. This one, yeah. Ow. Ow. Leave Merlin alone. Okay, let's see here. If I can get a couple busters off on this. Almost got him. Just don't kill Merlin. Either of them. Okay, yeah, I got him this turn. So there's only two two battles, and I'm, I can only assume that it's uh, it was a uh, random generated Oni. Oh, nope, nope, I was right. They're all here. <laughs> all right, let's do this. Oh crap. Oh, 
方の話をするとしよう攻めかけだ Not using the first Merlin because he'll automatically charge to 100% next turn anyway. Biggest problem I'm going to have is that Raikou's Null Phantasm is area of effect and it, it's effective against everybody. Just got to hope that I can keep throwing、uh, Invincibles up. Actually, wait. No, no, yeah, let's do this. Okay, the Sword Oni is definitely gone. The Caster will probably survive. Sword Oni, Saber Oni, you know, the one that's got the big, tall statue. Round two. That's a lot of HP. Fortunately, all she did was just charge our noble phantasms. No Phantasm next turn. Just doing this to get everyone else a little bit of charge. Ow! If I can, I'm gonna save Twin Arm Big Crunch for. After I get this HP meter going. Okay, it does look like quite broke it, but. Next turn. Alright. Just to be on the safe side. Okay. So that way I know she's gonna use.、Uh, Her、uh, ability next turn. Her noble phantasm, so I'm at safe. Of course, knowing my luck, she's probably gonna probably gonna become unparalyzed because usually an HP meter change is accompanied by debuff removed. Oh, no, not quite. Okay, so. Yeah.
just in general, I think this whole event was actually easier this time around. Mostly because Merlin is a thing when he wasn't last time. So, I think that made fighting the Onis a lot easier because you can do double Buster. And then, you got Emmy over here, who has a Buster type Noble Phantasm. And one of the main enemies was a uh, Saber class, so just everything dies. Do I even need to use a Noble Phantasm? Uh. May as well. Go out with a bang. Just to make sure that she stays dead. And she's gone. Well, that's all she wrote. Just one mission for this, uh, one little bonus mission for this event rerun. And now, we wait for the next chapter release, which by the time this video gets up, Argatha should already be up. At the time I'm recording this, I haven't decided if I'm going to do the whole event or if I'm just going to do the boss battles. It's going to depend on how long the event is, or not the event, the, uh, singularity is. Because I did all of Shinjuku because it was a pretty short chapter, and I did all of Seraph but it was a singularity and an event in one, which I was not expecting. So, I guess I'll decide before I actually start recording. You know, I mean, obviously, but before I actually start posting, I'll make a decision and I'll announce that whenever we actually get there. Okay, well, that's, that's all I have for this episode. Like I said, we'll pick back up whenever Argatha comes out. So, thank you all so much for watching. This has been Blade Cross EXE, part of Flash of Blades Productions. Tune in next time and we continue with Fate Grand Order. Peace out! Thank <laughs> you.